Hey, how you doing? Welcome back for Purple Bell Techniques. You know, when we're learning going up through the ranks, we learn that we're not just you know, doing a technique, we're not just doing a form. Every level that we advance in Kempo brings us a lot more closer to understanding about power, speed, fluidity, coordination. And that's how the bell levels were actually set up. Well, yellow and orange were what? The basic fundamentals, right? The format and the fundamentals. Purple belt, on the other hand, now we're beginning to develop the coordination that we built through our fundamentals. And that's what you're seeing now. So in purple belt, you see a lot of more combinations with your hands, simultaneous movements with the hands, more positional checks, more gravitational checks, more twi a little bit more twisters, a little bit more of a aggressive a a a adaptation with your strikes to manipulate your opponent on a higher level, middle zone, and a lower zone as well. So hopefully, um, the information that you will get out of the self-defense techniques will broaden your mind, even for those who already have a great basis of their art, and we'll see you in Blue Belt. So we're dealing with a dummy grabbing you and holding you like this and pulling you back. You know, they only say dummy because I wouldn't do that. But anyway, as he does, I'll take it from this angle. <laughs> I'm going to pivot with the right hand to his left arm, and as I do that, and I pull back, and I, and I go back, and I'm being forced back, I'm going to actually do a weighted straight check to the outside of his left arm. Mind you, I'm also protecting myself above the elbow, not below it, so I don't get a hit in the grill with it, you know what I mean? So make sure you keep it up here. As I do so, I'm going to execute a right horizontal elbow to his left kidney. From this point, it's taught that you pinch it with the right and you do it again then into the other side of his body, which is to his rib. But I like to diversify my strikes. So, from this point here, I'm going to weigh the straight check, I'm going to do the elbow to his left kidney, then pin his arm down, pop, elbow to his face, cross right out, one, two. All right, watch it again. Another thing is, I can use a little bit of jujitsu right there, because now I have a lock, not only because of the pin, but my arm, my neck resting on his wrist, and of course my shoulder turning, creates a little bit of a tweak on an arm to control it. So one, elbow, two, check, bam! There goes the face, and bada bing. In full speed. Yeah. 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 Yeah.